AMD love all the different suffixes for graphics cards being XD, XDX. The one that is probably the most confusing of all is GRE. And especially given the recent news of a RX 9070 GRE apparently launching soon, in anticipation of it, now's probably a good time to answer the question of what enough are these cards? Well, AMD themselves tell us that GRE stands for Great Radeon Edition, which doesn't really make much sense, especially given how these are usually cut down cards that have, well, less performance. I mean, looking at the leaks of the 9070 GRE, we can see that it already has less cores and also just 12 gigabytes of memory rather than 6 16 of the base model. So it's just a cut down card with less performance and ideally a lower price. Well, in theory, yes, however, there's another element to that. That being that these are intended for the Chinese market only, and models were sold exclusively in China. At least in theory, and now you can very easily buy GRE cards here in the West as well, so that didn't last too long. So some SKUs have been exclusive, some have been exclusive but kind of lenient, it's been a whole mess. Basically, the rules about these cards are changing with every single generation, and odds are AMD are going to yet again redefine what exactly makes a GRE card in terms of where it is actually sold with the brand new 9070 series as well. It's not the first time we've seen this kind of stuff. I mean, Nvidia themselves have also made stuff like the RTX 4090D, given how to abandon from selling the best performing GPUs to the PRC. However, this has nothing to do with that. It's not like AMD isn't allowed to sell the base 9070. It's more that they just somehow gauge that this kind of product makes more sense for the Chinese market, but then they realize it kind of makes sense for the whole world, so they didn't really bother the exclusivity. Like I said, it's a mess. But if it was available here, would you buy one of these when it comes out? Well, let me know down in the comments below, and maybe check out a Patreon, because even a single dollar a month truly goes a long way, plus huge thanks to Gavin Burns, Justin Rage, Olive Ronyak, Polish Volka, Patrick Harrison, not a pseudonym, Nick Sumner, and Shane Allcroft. But anyway, that's about it, so I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, then remember to subscribe, like whatever, and see you all in whatever I make next. Goodbye, everyone. Good. Bye.